Hey y'all, welcome back. So today I just wanted to share with you a small shopping haul that I did for some thank you wreaths that I'm going to be making for a couple of families that really helped us out this week. We had a family emergency and um, they just, you know, picked up the ball and they helped us get kids to school, get kids home from school and back home from volleyball games and fed them and then they loved on us once, um, you know, we were back home. So I just wanted to do something nice for them and so I'm going to be creating them some thank you wreaths. So we'll go ahead and I'll let you know um, where I purchased all of these items and I will try to let you know what, um, if there are any discounts, which most of them there were discounts. So we'll get through, we'll go like boring stuff to more exciting stuff. Um, so the first thing, boring, one of the boring items are, I got this pack of pipe cleaners from Michaels and right now this week they have a 20% off all regular purchase, um, items, so a regular price items. So this was a 20% off. I think this was under $3 and it has one, two, three, four, five different colors. So these, uh, pipe cleaners or yeah, chenille ties, I got a pack of those cause I was running low. Um, the other kind of boring, boring piece is my wreath farm. Okay, so at Michael's, I bought, there was one left. And it was, like, with tax, like $5. Well, and they only had one, so I needed more. So I went to Walmart. I was like, let me just check Walmart. These were $2 and change. So the one from Michael's will be going back. So I've got four or five of these. So, yeah. Okay, next, what I purchased, now this is, now I'm going to show you the order I think I'm going to um, make the wreath. So I purchased this um, mesh, it's a uh, part of the Christmas line, so original, it has it marked for $12.99, and this was 40% off I believe, and this is a um, green, black, and burlap color um, tartan. So I got two of those. I thought that was so pretty. So I'm really looking forward to seeing how this looks on a wreath. Um, and I kind of wanted, well, my first idea was I wanted a wreath that could last for um, fall and winter. And then, yeah, so fall and winter. I wanted them to be able to get two seasons out of it if they wanted to. So that's kind of the idea with this. So um, I think this is great. I know this seems very wintry, but with the green, I think it's going to be fine. So I bought two of these, and um, I purchased, uh, let's see, these mums. Now, they had individual mums. They were a little bit more pricey, but for this, this was 50% off. It was in, um, maybe it was 40, 50 or 40, I'm not sure. So $16, 50 or 40% off, probably 40 um, they had some stems that I had picked out that it was $5 for one. And since I'm doing two wreaths, you know, they the other one was a little bit better quality, but this is fine. I really like, um, I like this look. And since um, now is the time when everyone, in, during the fall is when everyone is harvesting their flowers and everything, I was like, okay, I can do florals on a fall wreath. That's fine. Um, yes. So I'm excited about these. So these I can divide up between the two wreaths. And if I have any left over, I can use it for, I have a bunch of wreaths I'm going to be making for Christmas presents too. So, um, okay. Then, I'm still looking for ribbon. Um, I found these at Walmart, and so I decided to go ahead and get them. Um, I'm going to see how it looks all together with the tartan. I don't know if it's going to clash, but I might be able to remove some of these. Um, this isn't really, so... This is like a burnt orange and burlap color, yeah, like mesh bow. So I don't know if you can see that real well. I know it. So I got this color, and this is a two-pack, and it's a pick. Well, it's honest, yeah, it's a pick. So, and so I got one, I got two of those. So four bows here in that color. And then I got, this one is white and burlap. So even if I take out these stripey ones, maybe they will compete with this. I'm just not sure. 
So I might take those out. So we'll see. And then this is what it looks like. So with the trying to. So yeah, that might kind of clash a little bit. So we'll see. But you know, now Walmart is running low on their fall stuff because they're getting all the Christmas in. So I just wanted to pick up a bunch because I will use them for sure. So I like those. And then my favorite thing, and I need to go and get the other monogram, but my favorite thing is this large, I'm going to say aluminum, monogram tag. So this is like a rose gold or like a copper tag shape, and you see on the back, it's just like galvanized and it's hollow. Um... So this is going to go in the middle of the wreath. And I think it's going to be so pretty. So I'm really excited about that. This was 40% off of $16.99. So this is a little pricier, but I mean, it's really big. And they have, right now they have a bunch of letters. So I need to go and get the other monogram, maybe two, that I need for this. So um, I didn't tell you how much these were. These were $2.99 for the double, $2.99. And it was, that's just the price. Those aren't on sale. And then this single one was 98 cents at Walmart. Yeah. So I think that's everything. Now, I might, like I said, I want to get a ribbon or something else. I was looking at a um, another floral, and it was, it had leaves on it. And the leaves, it was like a $6 pick. And I didn't want to spend $6. So I think I'm going to go to Hobby Lobby and try to find a, um, you know, like one of these. Is this called a pick? A bush. I'm going to go try to find a bush with more leaves. But the leaves were really pretty. They were green and then they had kind of like a blush in them. But it was uh, very muted. And that's what I thought would look really good. So this on the background, the muted leaves with a couple mums. And my copper and white distressed monogram. So that's what I'm going to be putting together. I'm going to go ahead and do the wreath. And if I need to add in something else like those leaves, then I will go ahead and do that. And I'll just um, kind of show it, you know, maybe at the end of the video. So that's all I have for right now. It was really fun. Um, you know, you when you're creating for someone for as for a gift for them, you have a lot of fun thinking about them, what they would like, what their style might be, and just, you know, you get to spend that, I feel it's quality time, really thinking about them and how they blessed your life. So, um, you know, definitely if there's somebody that you just want to show appreciation for, um, making a wreath for them is a really, really good idea. And you can make a wreath with supplies from the Dollar Tree. It could be from anywhere. The Dollar Tree, Walmart, Michaels, Hobby Lobby. Um, just, you know, go have fun and create. You can even um, make the smaller size wreath. They will appreciate it. So, um, yeah, I just encourage you to go ahead and reach out to someone and create for them this upcoming week or two and just let them know how much you appreciate them and what they mean to you in your life. So I hope you're doing well, and um, I'll have the video up probably in a couple days. So see you later.